Hello, good day. This is Hunter357 the Reviewing Daddy, and today we're gonna review this. It's the Voltmate Digital Multimeter, and this is how I got it out of the shipping box. Alright, and let's check it out. So just so you know, I am not a pro and I'm not an electrician, I'm not even like trained to use one as of now I just watch a YouTube video on how to use it and that's what I'm going to use on this review so if I miss some things or anything like that I'm sorry but again I'm not a pro in this I just want to review this for you guys alright so out of the box this is what I got a manual the, the cable cords and the, the probes I mean and the multimeter and the multimeter is covered in plastic so let's remove that there you go. all right now they said a good multimeter needs to measure at least resistance voltage ACDC and continuity and so far based on the manual here it looks like this multimeter um, measures DC voltage, AC voltage, um, continuity, current, resistance, temperature, capacitance, and battery test. Uh, for this video, since I'm not a pro, I don't want to mess up that much, I'll just be doing continuity, um, DC voltage, and maybe AC, I'm not sure though, but this is not automatic, this is manual, so you need to figure out those things here. But again, we have a manual here that you can check it out and um, there's also tons of videos in YouTube that you can use as a reference if you are also a beginner on how to use a multimeter All right. it's uh, running on a 9 volt battery All right, and it's provided so it's really really cool and there's a stand there so you can do it like that but for this video I'll just keep it like that we're going to try to test the battery um, the black cable only always needs to go at the common slot there and you put it there and the red probe if you're measuring voltage resistance continuity or milliampere you can go here but if you're using um, 10 ma's uh, 10, 10 amperes max it's on here this one I'm not gonna mess with this one since I, uh, I'm not sure on how to use it again as I've said I'm just using it as of now after watching one video in YouTube and this is the first time I actually use one All right so I'm just gonna put this there there you go and then gonna open it up Oh, no, this. And since I'm going to go with DC on this time, um, I'm going to put it right there. And measures up to 20 volts on that one. So this is uh, a regular AA battery and it should be measuring 1.5 volts. So let's check it out. There you go. And if you got the polarities wrong, it's going to be just negative. So on this battery, it's, me it's measuring 1.58. You know what? Let's, let's try to measure other batteries. And this one measures 1.43. Um, based on the YouTube channel that I said, if it's plus or minus 0.2, that's fine. So, so far, it's accurately reading these batteries. So for AC, it's going to be this signal, and I'm going to go for up to 200. So I have my outlet here. There you go. One hundred twenty-two voltage. 
All right, for the last one, we're measuring continuity, and that measures if your cable or a circuit board is broken or what. And what's gonna happen is it's gonna beep like that if it's um, okay. And the reading will be close to zero or zero if everything is okay. And that means the electricity signals or whatever is flow flowing really, really great. And we have um, audio cable here, which is working. So this should beep. Oops. There you go. So uh, it works. And again, there's other more stuff that can be done with this voltmeter. Um, again, there's uh, it's digital, and I think you can hold the reading on this one. Let's see. So like you want to hold that oh. So like if you want to hold the reading or something like that, you just press that hold and it stays there. Also there's a light here. So if you're working in the dark, it's really uh you can still see it. So hold is okay if you're like um I need to write it down and stuff like that. It's going to be there and you press it again, it's going to be gone. And again, this is digital, it's not the analog thing like that, so it's really, really great. Again, it runs on 9 volt batteries, there's stand here. You can measure AC, DC, vol um, amperes, persistence, um, temperature, continuity. It really, really is good, uh, a digital voltmeter. So, if you want to check it out, um, just check the description below or um, check my blog. And again, this is Hunter357, the Reviewing Daddy, and thank you for watching.